Good evening and welcome to Nine's Late News and we begin with breaking news. There are fresh alerts in Sydney tonight with three new venues added to the exposure site list in the past hour. Visited by positive cases in the new cluster that has spread... Good afternoon. Gladys Berejiklian has sensationally resigned as Premier of New South Wales after being made the subject of a public inquiry by the Independent Commission Against Corruption. The watchdog is investigating whether the outgoing Premier breached... Tonight, a $600 million boost for the Hunter. Controversial plans unveiled for a new gas-fired power station to shore up affordable energy. Good evening, I'm Juanita Phillips. This is ABC News. Great shots. Thank you for your company this evening from the team here at 7 News. That is the latest. I'm Michael Usher. Have a great night. Nine News with Alicia Loxley. Good evening. The curtain has fallen on Australia's greatest showman. Bert Newton has died aged 83. A true giant of the entertainment industry, Bert made millions laugh on radio. Chris Barth. There's a genuine sense of sadness across Australia today following the death of Bert Newton. The man they called Moonface was there at the beginning of television and had kept us entertained on the... ...with Sandra Sully. Good evening. It has been a truly momentous day in the history of our state. Gladys Berejiklian is no longer our Premier. Brought down not by the pandemic, not by the bushfires, but by her... Ex ...with Georgie Gardner. Good evening. There were disturbing scenes today as anti-lockdown protesters clashed with police in Sydney and Melbourne. Many without masks, demonstrators took their anger to the streets. Just with Peter Overton. Good evening. Please stay with us. That was the plea from a desperate government today to a city and a state fatigued by lockdown and dismayed by frustratingly high COVID numbers. Don't know about you, Pete, but that suits me to a T. That <laughs> sounds pretty good. Thank you, Steph. And Melbourne, that's what's news this Wednesday. Layla's next with The Current Affair. Enjoy your evening and good night.